Hello everyone, welcome. It's Ryan here for the London Craftsman. Today is all about setting in this brass strip into a piece of oak veneer. This is the top for this particular job that we're doing. This is the top here. And we're just setting in that brass strip here just to give it a bit more bling. So today is about using the Trends T18S um, cordless trimmer router. And we've used this quite a lot for the past six months or so, and we like it. Um, it's nice and lightweight and it's quite versatile. It does a lot of different things as well. So you've got all different bases and different fences, but it's just about setting this, uh, setting this strip in. So what I've done is I've just got the fence set up to my router and I've set it 60 mil away from the start of this flute cutter. We've got a 12.7 mil. Is it 12.7 mil? Uh, yep, 12.7 mil flute cutter. It's got a ball bearing on it. We're not using any of that. We're only setting it in by three mil and we're just simply gonna run that fence along the edge, like so, all the way, and just drop that strip in. Um, but before we do that, I'm just gonna set up my piece, make sure it's correct, make sure I've got the depth correct and the 60 mil in. So I'm gonna clamp that on, give it a little test run, try the strip in and yeah, see if it's right. So before I start, I just wanna say that this strip is very slightly um, wider than the cutter itself. So once I've done one pass, I'm gonna have to move that fence and move it in by one mil to make that groove one mil wider but what i'm just going to do now is i'm just going to run it once just to make sure i've got the depth right i could just sort of eyeball that strip in so yeah it's set up now let's give it a go okay so let's give it a go make sure we've got enough on the battery got two bars that should do this do this job unlock have to be careful because it did just kink in you can see that fence doesn't run all the way through to be honest i don't know why they don't do that why don't they just make that a solid bar or give you the option to so you don't get that kink right at the end you've got to be careful but um yeah while i'm dusting this out I get my mask on brush it out it's not gonna go i'm sure it isn't oh it is gonna go it is gonna go I thought it wasn't wide enough, but because of that kink, it's not going in there. If you try here, Sean, look. Can you get that one in? And it's ever so slightly lower, which I wanted because we've got a glass topper going on this as well. I don't want it to be anywhere near the glass. I want it to be slightly below. And once I swipe these and take the sharp arises off, it should be nice. It should just flow in nicely. Like I said, the glass topper will hide all that. So I'm happy that that's right. Just got to make sure that when I pass it on the real thing, when I get to the end, I hold that router nice and steady so I don't get this horrible kink. That little kink there, can you see? So we know that's right. I'm actually happy to just go for that straight away. Let's do it. Cross fingers, we don't get that kink at the end and you can see the finished product because this is going to look really awesome once it's done. Okay, double check, I've got enough power. I quite like that. Two bars. Unlock it, turn it on. I'm gonna take my time.
yeah, that happened quite quickly. So let's get my mask on while I'm dusting this off. Always be careful, especially with MDF. Okay, so that's how that fits. So you'll see the finished products now. Yeah, so I did get a very slight kink. So I'm just gonna take that out with the chisel. There we go. Let's give it another go. Yeah. Lovely. So there you go, guys. What do you think? I think that came out really nice. And it's a nice little um, touch, isn't it? A bit of brass on oak. It is going to be painted, unfortunately. It's going to go in a, like a khaki green colour, but we did it on oak veneer, so the grain shows through. But yeah, with the topper on the top, the brass in, the tapered legs, it's going to look pretty awesome. So yeah, the tool done it really nicely. The trend tool, the trend router, really happy with that. So there you go, guys. Um, I just wanted to show you that. Didn't want you to miss it. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, take it easy. Have a good rest of the day. Ciao for now. <laughs>